Hello, my most amazing artists. Today, we're going to make a spider for the web that you painted last time. So your web should be nice and dry, your crayon lines have shown through, and now we're going to make the spider. So I have a six inch by half inch pieces for the legs. These, there's eight of them. And I have a square of black paper. So I made one with short legs and I made one with long legs. Um, we're going to make the long leg ones. Um, you can decide at home which ones you want to make to put on your cider web. So on the square, I'm going to make an oval or a circle shape. Spiders have eight eyes, so I'm going to color two big ones and then the other ones are, seem to be kind of small. And then you can put a symbol on his back. Um, usually the hourglass for the black widow spider is the most popular. Um, you could do red, venomous spider, you can do any other symbol um, that you would like to add. I'm just going to color that in and then I can cut it out. Alright, I'm going to cut that out. And then I'll show you how to glue and fold the legs so that your spider pops up off the top of your spider web. Okay, so there's my body. Now I'm going to take the, the legs. I'm going to take a couple at a time. I'm going to fold them in half. So that's the knee. And then wherever the knee bends up, I'm going to fold just a little bit in for the foot. Okay, I'm going to flip the body over. I'm going to put some glue stick on the back. And I want those knees to perk up so his fit, foot should be in the air. And then you're going to fold the other two. So fold it in half. And then make that knee pop up and fold a little foot. Flip them over. Put it on my spider. Okay, I need a little more glue stick on the other side. I'm going to fold those legs, fold them in half, make that knee pop up through the foot, flip them upside down. Glue it to the back. Looks like I'm missing a leg. Thought I had all my legs. Okay. And I must be missing a leg. So I'm just going to use the other one. Grab my spider. And then I would glue his feet so that he sticks up on the web. So I would just put a little glue stick on his feet and then make him pop up off the top of your spider web. These will look awesome for Halloween decorations around the house. Have fun with this. Can't wait to see them.